This is my editing setup, but I'm not actually editing off of this computer. I'm actually editing off a computer that's 70 miles away in a completely different city. And I do this by using Parsec. So Parsec is a remote desktop app that specializes in low latency connections. And if you're creative, I think you really need to check this out. It's low latency delivery means that you can connect to a computer that's completely remote and the playback will be so quick and smooth that you forget you're using a completely different computer. It really makes remote work feel local. And I'm not just talking any like normal computer work, I'm talking graphic intensive gaming and video editing type work. It's really what allowed me to move cities about a year and a half ago and still keep the same job, even though it's an hour and a half away and I never had to commute or drive down there or anything. Parsec streams your remote desktop at 60 frames per second. It gives you a keyboard and mouse control. It plays back audio in real time, and it works across all the different platforms, Mac, PC, Linux, and you can even try the basic version for free. If you're a gamer, then you know that gaming is one of the most intensive things for your computer to handle. So what if you had this sweet, like, beefed up rig, but none of your friends have a computer that can really handle gaming? You could just share access to your computer through Parsec, and you could play together with your friends remotely. And if you can game remotely without having a computer that's completely juiced up to the gills, then that's pretty promising. I figured if Parsec can handle gaming, then it can probably handle other graphic intensive work, like video editing, post-production, coding, engineering, really anything that might require a powerful computer, but that doesn't mean it has to tie you down to a single location. So low latency tech is what makes this all work. It's what makes you capable of editing videos remotely without the lag or delay that would really make your workflow impossible. They built their own Parsec SDK in cross-platform C and they have a custom built UDP protocol called BUD, which in English just means that it was designed to give you a low latency video delivery, a fast transfer, minimal delay, but it's depending on your network. Internet connection is going to be crucial when it comes to using the software. You can find a bunch of case studies on the website that document their progress in updating the software. It's a really interesting read. You might have to Google some terms, but I definitely recommend it. Monitoring, making sure that your visuals and color grading are playing back accurately across any different devices or monitors. I admit I'm still struggling with this because there's a lot of intermingling going on here with a bunch of different devices and brands that we use. But really accuracy is not an issue because the standard image playback they give you is still pretty incredible and they do offer a 444 coloring and multi-monitor connection so if you have a monitor that's more professional for color grading you could connect that to your computer and use it with Parsec. Now you might be worried about giving other people access to your main desktop but the people at Parsec seem to take security pretty seriously. All the connections are peer-to-peer, -peer, so Parsec isn't spying on you, nothing is being sent to them, they're not tracking you or seeing what you're doing on somebody else's desktop. If you have Parsec for Teams and Enterprise, you have access to an administration panel. You can manage permissions and assign roles to people, create a hierarchy, you can kick people out of it. They really give you the power to configure your security settings and make sure that your team is secure. Again, their website dives into all the nitty gritty details about this. Articles, case studies, blogs. I really like how their website is laid out because they take a lot of this advanced terminology and tech lingo, but they explain it pretty clearly and they put it in basic English and it's really fun to read. It also seems like the developers really do care about this product and really care about improving it and helping people. I know remote work is a big topic these days. I worked from home for about a year because I was able to use Parsec and now I have the luxury of being hybrid and having 
an office to come to and having the flexibility. I get that remote work or hybrid work just doesn't work for some people or for some companies for whatever reason. But all I wanna say is like, just learn the possibilities of it and think about how you could integrate it into your workflow and what could change. If you're a creative or a worker, then be open to the potential of this. No one has to be tied down or limited to a single location anymore, and you really can't be in today's world. I know for us, it's allowed us a lot of flexibility as a company, and it's allowed us to grow and adapt, and I feel like we haven't even scratched the surface of what we're capable of now. And for me personally, it's allowed me to move and make some pretty big life changes. I'm much happier with my current situation, and I really don't think I could have done it without using Parsec.